so we made a transfer. I'm not so certain about the Yes, my people, like and share to my channel and subscribe to see the next video coming out and hit the icon bell. See in? Yeah, see the next video while they come out. See in? Subscribe button. Right, so Yeah, man. Just press it. Yeah, man. Like and share. Watch your views. More and some more views. Give me some more views. See in? Yes, my people. Respect our manners. <laughs> So the score moves to 5 for 1. 5 without loss, sorry. Ready is up to 5. <laughs> So it's now hit without last riddles. So what you say? <laughs> so Gadel into ball to Chip Chip. And that's a good forward defensive shot by Chip Chip. Chep Chep seem motivated today to get this victory. This is a very, very well anticipated game. 
Rasta go knock out your stump. Yes, yes. That I go reach him. So Gadel building up the pressure. Just back up for length outside half stump. And that was a full length delivery. <laughs> so we have long pan this through the pace. Up to goal at a good length. Full length delivery. Just that middle stump. So 
already scores 18 for one. I think Redhead should be looking to 160 plus to put up a fight against his high team. Samora up to ball to. Oh, and that's a good delivery. Took the outside hedge. Just drop shot of Raskadel. So Raskadel up to ball to timing. Can he time this one away? Oh, and a little bit of movement, bringing it down the leg side. You can see what Raskadel is trying to do. Get that ball to jog back. Samora Reed up to ball two. So Red is 18 for one, batting first. I think that was a loose delivery. Taimi should be cursing himself, missing out on that one. So can Samora get rid of Chip Chip? And that was a good delivery. Come on, Samora. Remember, sir, Chip Chip, Chip, Chip up. decided to stand behind that one. Taking one for the team. <laughs> so some more from the cow pass stand. Oh, and that's a beautiful delivery. Beat everything. Oh, and that's a good delivery. And well played by Timey. I'm wondering if Timey can get his front foot down the pitch a little bit more and stroke that through the covers. working on a plan right here. Four for one. The man dismissed 
And that was a good delivery. Finish. Outside half stump. Trying to get time to flash at that one. Samora. Full leg delivery and leg stump. Chep Chep using his Adidas. Football boot to good effect. Come on, Chep is on six. <laughs> so, Hyder's. Been able to keep a check on the run rate. So far, it's just 25 runs on the board. Sorry, 24 runs on the board for one wicket. Hyde yeah, yeah. has been bowling consistent length and some very testing lines as well. So Rascadel with 81 in his back, up to ball to. Oh, and that's a creative shot by Timey. Seems like he's watching the IPL. So it's Samora with a very high. We are holding the bat. Looking to this bat, Samora. Over the cow pass stand for six. Can he do it? So Samora making some adjustment to his field. Now he's up to ball to Chip Chip. And that's a good full leg delivery. And that was stripped away down to long run. Come on, Chip, you man, I could have it too, man. Let the man come meet you, man. Bimbo, Bimbo so far seems like he's at the skate ring at V Barnet Lawn, skating around in his Air Force Nike. Once again, some more up to ball to timing. And that's a good Yorker delivery. Timey knew nothing about that one. <laughs> so Gadel looking for his second wicket. Up to ball to Chip Chip. Come on Chip Chip. Come on Chip Chip. <laughs> and then ball go Chip you up. <laughs> <laughs> Next time in the eating gun, I just switch up. So that one was clipped away to Skrillex for a single. So already it seems like they're placing some emphasis on the rotation of the strike. Not looking to deal in boundaries. So we have Gibraltar, Midland, a batsman, Hinzeman, who hack. The man who won the biggest bat in the league, check it in. <laughs> Last week when they put that bat on the scale, I think it was 15 pounds. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's still a met the nice. And that was a good delivery by Samuel, just back off a length, talking up the batsman. What you saying? <laughs> what you saying? All right, no worries, if I'm going to work Oh, and Chip Chip was swinging for pump pumps there. Mm, well, go on. Breeze off the bat, you could feel it all the way in the, in the pavilion. <laughs> Can Nico take this one? Oh, and that's a brilliant catch by Nico. Full length swinging delivery. Enticing time to go for that shot over the covers. Mm -hmm. 
So Rasgadel picking up his second wicket. Yes. So Chep Chep is moving around in the wicket, trying to get some more of that nugget line and length. So Rasgadel, the strike bowler for eye blasters, looking for his third wicket. And that was another good delivery. <coughs> so news just coming into the commentary box. Jason was transferred for two dozen okra. So two dozen okra was the transfer fee for Jason. So it's Gadel up to ball to Jason. And that's a good delivery. So that was pulled away by Jason for six, straight to the hands of Skipper Rabbi. I'm wondering if that same hand is what he used to collect the 12 okra. Because there's a lot of slime. He wasn't able to hold on to that one and the deep mid wicket boundary. So Gadiel looking to get this wicket. Another good delivery. So I'm not sure if it's because of how bad Manu lost this morning, but Gadel is taking his revenge on the Red Hills batsman. Samoa. Not a full length delivery. So Samoa has bowled so far 60 deliveries without getting a wicket. His energy levels are going down. I'm not sure if Bimbo have this finish next to him. <laughs> so, some are steaming in. Up to ball to Chep Chep. Oh, Ooh, and that was a wild swing. What a one. Connected. What a one. It seems like Chep Chep want to hit our ball back to Red Hills <laughs> so they can use it for even cricket. <laughs> So Samora up to ball to Chep Chep once more. Another quick delivery, but half target. So Jason looking very, very <coughs> patient, looking like a test batsman playing for bad light. So it's Charlie once again up to ball to Jason. And now Jason is looking to turn into a 2020 batsman. So we have the Top Town Sports Club bar. Right under the top all in here next to the scoring booth. So can Redis put a big total on the board? Yes. Oh, and that's a brilliant shot. Oh, and that was brilliantly taken. And that was a super catch by Super Gellin. You can see that he's watching IPL. For one moment I thought that was going over for six. But somehow Super Gellin with his okra. So it's Gadel into Baltimore. And a good full length delivery, searching delivery on half stump. Mane playing a forward defensive stroke. So Gadel so far proving to be the chump card for Hyde. As Samora continue to be frustrated by the ready skipper Chep Chep. So it's 32 for 3. Ready is taking their time this evening. So Gadel changing, coming around the wicket to the left hander. Oh, and that's a beautiful delivery. 
That's always a difficult delivery for the left handers. Angling in and just moving away. So Ross Gadel is on farm. So so far it's Eid Eid Blasters on top. Avin Reddy's down now for 30. 32 for 3. Reddy's struggling. Can they mount a challenge? <laughs> so we have the Top Town Sports Club bar. Everything is here. Even for the batsman who's not making any runs. Drink something from the bar and you're sure of an half century. <laughs> so it's Chip Chip opening the batting still on 10. I think he faced for 62 balls. Um, I'm not sure if it's a plan from the Red Hill skipper, but so far he's 10 runs of 63 deliveries. Gadel with 3 wicket to his name, up to ball to morning. Samuel looking for his first wicket. To be honest, despite not getting a wicket, Samuel has been very, very economical. So far, conceding only five runs. I'm wondering if he's only looking to restrict the run rate while Gadel do the strikes. So Gadel with three wickets for 27 runs. And that was smash. Mm. Much better, man. <coughs> so Samara looking for his first wicket. Up to ball to Chip Chip. Yes. Oh, Chip Chip! Wash! Chip Chip! That's the six. That last. That was a massive hit. God, God, Chip Chip. That was a ferocious hit. Who was like? <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, you're not playing. I see a wreck chip 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 side. <laughs> So Ross Gadel with five wickets to his name, five for twenty seven. Five for twenty seven for Ross Gadel. Samora just been dispatched to the Kingston Airport. And it seems like Chip Chip. It seems like Chip Chip decide that Samora is the target. And I think that is good batting, looking to stay behind the ball because Ross Gadel is getting the ball to move. <laughs> can Gibral, can Reddys dig themselves out of this hole? Chep Chep still at the crease. <laughs> so Charlie, sure. up the ball to Andre. AKA Weatherman. <laughs> Can he strike like the weather? <coughs> Somewhere still looking for his first wicket. I like this competition here, this competition between Samora and Chep Chep. Samora has just been hit straight back on his veranda at Hyde. <laughs> And that's a brilliant delivery. Seems like an off cutter. Chep Chep just call a conference in the middle of the pitch with the non-striker. And that's a good short delivery. So checking in, we have Cheddar Oliver, the man with the biggest bunch of key. I think he has about 272 key on that bunch. So <laughs> Ross Gadel up to ball. Oh, and that's another good delivery. Pressure is piling on this Reddings team. Yeah. It's important that they make this game competitive. Can they find a partnership? So we have once again Charlie with five wickets to his name into ball to Andre and another good delivery, good forward defensive shot by Andre. It's important. Reddings get a partnership, but Jadel is looking for a six. Mm -hmm. Cross chip chip side. Get him a tricky ball now, Charlie. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch out, watch out, chip. So once again, Chip Chip is calling another emergency meeting in the middle of the pitch. <laughs> <laughs> chip Chip! So the score is still. 
All right, different man for the attack. Still 38 for 5. You call them name them, man? So Hyde has made a change and brought in Super Gelding. No! Oh, that's smashed away for 6. So Super Gelding is here to dish out the Sunday dinner. So Super Gelden up to ball to Andre. Aye. Oh, that's a good delivery. Seems like it was going to be a full toss, but that dip at the last minute. What do you mean? Who's up behind them? So Samora still trying to discover his first wicket. Up to ball to Chep Chep. Another defensive shot by Chep Chep. You can see that Samora is trying to just dry up the runs. Yes, Rasta. Good delivery by Wiley. Starting outside the half stump and cut back. Oh, and that was pumped. Lovely shot, that Chep Chep. A rocket. Not even the very swiftly Bimbo could get a hand to that. Chap, chap. That was hammered. Too long off for four. Chip Chip seemed to be targeting Samora. <laughs> Discussion by Chip Chip. It seems man, like he's telling his man, man, not to call for the shot. Man. You don't understand. You don't understand, man. You don't understand. You don't see what they're going on now. <laughs> what am I saying? You see, I saw you the wind and the door and everything, you know. Hey, God. All the floor, I'm the year. Hey, God. Say that the house. So, Samora once again up to Chep Chep. Looking to get this wicket. So, Wiley looking for that magic delivery. Super Gelding looking to get the breakthrough for high blasters with another delivery down the leg side. Ready is his 48 for 5 looking to put up a good total and that's a good very good forward defensive stroke. Chep Chep playing a captain inning so far. Can he see through to the end? Looking to play solidly behind the good delivery and dispatch the bad deliveries. So it's Samora once again. Oh, and that's a good delivery. Full length and half stump. But chip chip equal to that. And you could you could see the plan that Wiley have against Andre. He's looking to get him to bust the sky. Delivery. Rasta, you call out the one there. So it's Samora oh still God. looking for his first wicket. But Chep Chep is very, very determined. 
Mangadash in Plever. Chep Chep know that this high team possess some good batsmen, so they need runs on the board. So Zamora with a sharp delivery. And that was well played. I think this is good. Yes, very, very smart batting. Wow. But Kenny take over. his team to watch a good photo. They're now 49 for 5. Red is 49 for 5. Sent it to back by eye blasters. Sure. Easy. So, with Andre struggling to get behind the deliveries, can Samora get his first wicket? Here comes Samora. Oh, and that was a good, that was well played. As I said earlier, it seems like Bimbo is, in, is at Skateland in the summer, skating around. He has been sliding over the whole field. So Samara looking to get the wicket of Andre with a full leg delivery. Seems like there was a single there. Hmm? And that was well played. Indeed, I want. Indeed, I want. Oh God, man. Wiley, you see it. You see it, Wiley. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, Get me, man. Then I don't run for the boy. Get me, man. I <laughs> 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 twenty out there. <laughs> oh, <better> no. <laughs> Anything can happen. So that was a risky sing single by Reddings. Risky single, however. <laughs> they have just brought up their 50. 50 for 5. Reddings <laughs> struggling so far. Yeah. <laughs> Chep Chep looking to play a textbook cover Yes, my drive. people, like and share to my channel and subscribe to see the next video coming out and hit the icon so bell. See, yeah, see the next video when it comes out. See, subscribe button right there, so yeah, man, just press it. Yeah, man, like and share. Watch your views. More and some more views. Give me some more views. See, yes, my people, respect our manners. Pressure, even if they went to the state in America with the most COVID-19, they won't be able to catch it. <laughs> so the score is now 54 for 5. Reddell sent into bat. Some are still wicketless. Oh, and that was smoke! Yes, that Jeff, was Jeff. Through the extra cover boundary for 4. Chep Chep swinging with all his might. Bossy boy, Chep Chep. I am telling you, Robbie was like one inch away from it and couldn't stop it. delivered by Wiley. Meet the batsman outside the half stump. Wiley seemed to be getting into his stride now. 
but Samora has been targeted by the Red Hills team as the weak link. Oh, and that was smoke over wide long off for six. So after being put down just a moment. Yes, Chepe. So high blasters making wow. a change to their bowling. Now we have Lee Cup coming to the attack. Right, one kill. You want to kill it. So Red Hills making steady progress now, 64 for 5. Everybody's nervous each time the ball goes to dirt because it's gonna fly past him in the dirt. <laughs> oh, and that was smoke. Oh, my video kid for six. Reddings is getting back into the game after a slight injury by the height strike bowler Rascadel who was taken. I'm asking the medical personnel at the ground to check Rascadel. I just see him with a, a nurse drive up with a sewage. I'm not sure if it's steroids. <laughs> So Rascadel, after being injured two seconds ago, quickly, so you can see that the Red Hills medical team is working. I, I must I must commend the Red Hills medical team for working on the right shoulder of Rascadel. So Samora, oh, and that's a vicious shot delivery. I could see Chep Chep smelling that delivery. Smells like strawberry from out here. Oh, and that's a good delivery. So Gadel bowling with a injury, looking to get a six for. So we have Cyril Bass just checking into the building. <laughs> So Reddings is now 70 for 5, making progress from Gibraltar Royals. And that's another job catch by Samora. To be honest, I'm not surprised. I am not surprised. This man can't catch even COVID-19. <laughs> so Samora up to go to Chep Chep. And that was well played. A word of advice to Chep Chep not to take any chance because Ethan is one of the best feeder on this high team. In the man who had, we just got news that is bad. He had the mechanic shop. The best mechanic in the parish is working on it. He's about to have some technical issues. <laughs> so Skipperino can expect runs <laughs> as soon as it's fixed. His bat is getting an eye change. <laughs> so once again, Samora up the ball to Chip Chip. Oh, and that's a good shot delivery into the ribs. So Samora is now targeting the ribs of Chip Chip. Once again, I have to shout out Skipper Robbie for his, his investment in the medical team for eye blasters because um, Gadel was just injured but quickly recovered. So we have to pick up the medical team from the eye blasters squad. Ras Gadel looking for his sixth wicket. Oh, and this is very, very good batting by Andre. Looks a very patient player. Seems like he's thinking the cricket. So 
will get it once more. Oh, and that was a classical shot. That was a shot of class. That was played on the up through the covers for four. For me, that is the shot of the afternoon. So it's now 74 for five. Red Hills. Red Hills, after being struggling at 30 something for five, is making progress. Can hide. Can hide blasters break this partnership. It is very clear. Samoa, take a break, Samoa. It is very clear that Samoa has run out of steam. Take a break. Yeah, man. I think he bowled about 200 deliveries without getting an appeal. Don't kill yourself, man. So now we have dirt. Oh, and that's a gift. But Chip Chip decided to leave that gift for Christmas. So Ross Gaden after a speedy recovery up to ball to Chip Chip. Come on, Chip Chip. To be honest, this is one of the longest innings I've seen. It's now 5 p.m. Reddies have taken a lot of time to score. I am sure that didn't hit anywhere near the middle of the bat right, right. because the way Chep Chep has been swinging, anything connect in the middle, the digital pole should be on the threat. <laughs> So the score is 81 for 5. Hide is. And that was a miss hit. Yeah, yeah, screw. Miss hit for 4. Watch out. Watch out. Yo, yo. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to go and go to the one I do. Oh, I'm doing it, man. Get some more. Get some more. Make it on ball. Man, I'm ball, Robbie. So, Ross Gadel, bowling through pain, took five wickets and is off the attack. Oh, my God. If Chip Chip connect one of these balls in the middle. No, you're in history, no man. That's what you say. So Dirts, so Dirts is serving up the ball like he's burnt out of. So Chep Chep, Chep Chep with a captain in it so far. He's not out on 42 runs. And Gibraltar is now 85 for five. Yes. Yeah, man. Yeah. You can't win. Yeah, no, man. I tell you have to tell yourself. No, man. I tell man. Of course. Of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah, man. I want to, man. Yeah, man. So, hide. Hide getting a little bit shaky at the moment. I'm wondering what happened, why Hyde Strike Bowler got in his off the attack. Oh, and that's a super catch. As I stated earlier, you can't give this young man not even an half chance. I'm sure our resident cameraman, Ever Sleep Media, will put a nice replay on that one tomorrow. Last one is. It was a good knock by Andre. A very vital 26 runs on the board. I think he got a good in there. 
said, check it out. Anything from the bar and you'll make runs or get wicked, I guarantee. So we have Dirts with his labor right cap turned back way. Hope to bow to the new batsman. Bat straight man, play straight. So Samora still searching for his first wicket. So Chep Chep trying to intimidate Samora. <laughs> I am wondering if Chep Chep is personally targeting Samora as the weak link. <laughs> and that was another chance for Samora. That was Samora's 100 drop catch in his career. Samara has brought up a century of job catches. <laughs> so Samara up to ball to Chip Chip. <laughs> oh, that was a gift <laughs> by Chip Chip giving Samara his first wicket. <laughs> I think Samara has finally learned that when a batsman is rushing out, we definitely have to big up dirt because the odds of dirt taking that catch was 50 to 1. So Chip Chop missing out on his half century by 8 runs, making 42. I still think it was a very good knock. So, Halir, looking to get on it. Oh, I think that one was there for that shot. So now we have Radha at the crease. One of the very promising young players in the community. Let's see if he still has it. Oh, and Radha seemed to be hiding. A little bit of steam. Come on, Rana, do something. Do something, Rana. And that was swung over to the square leg for a single. A little bit more power on that, and he would get a four. But we still have it in. Don't know. Samora has finally taken a run out as well. Big improvement by Samora. Can they get to 100 to make the game competitive? So it's Boskin, aka Dirts. It's dirt up to ball to Teddy Brock shot from Shutters. Oh, that's a brilliant shot with the head back. I won't get the style. You can see that Teddy Brock shot head back full of drive. 86. Ethan is the wrong man to try and run a single too. Very good feeler in the eye blasters team. So once again, it's Teddy Brock shot. So Teddy Brock shot. I'm not sure if his blood is circulating properly in that leggings. So Teddy Brock shot in the tight pants. Oh, and that was a brilliant shot. All the way for six. By Teddy Brockshot. 
the man who has his polo shirt tucked into his leggings. Once again, to go to Teddy. The wide delivery. Teddy Brookshot is swinging for the stands. Yeah, man, I got to forgive man. So this is the hard eating Teddy Brock shop. Struggling to run in that leggings. But he looked good for Mm -mm. Oh, nice that was a French cut. Nice for Alan. For run. So high, high giving away Christmas gifts in October. <laughs> oh, that's a good shot by Teddy Brock shot. But knee cup was well positioned. Teddy Brock shot, man. All right, chef, chef. I have to use the catch line. So the score is 96 all out. Wow. Oh, four more. Missing out on 100 runs. We have our groundsman. Yeah, this guy here is the 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 the, the, the team manager. You know? Yeah. This guy here in the yellow Gansy. You know? Yeah. He's the team manager. Yeah, for ready his team. Alright? Yeah, man. Manager, you know? Manager. Robbie is coming out back to back half centuries. Can he make another 53 in a row? Based on the news from the Red Hills team, they stated that anything above 60, they have the ball in to defend it. Well, they have 37 extra. So we have the lady rookie taker in the Top Town Sports Club Invitational Cricket Sundays. Chep Chep steaming into ball to Rabi. Wow. Wow, and that was clipped away wow, for a single. So Why is that? He look a 90 and not the Rabi. So Chep Chep up the ball to Ethan. Yes. I'm not sure what's wrong with Chip Chip today. But when I look at the big screen to the left, that ball was about 50 miles an hour. Oh, that's a Get in the front of Robbie. Yeah, I believe that. Robbie, dismiss for one. Oh, God, I look at the young yeah, trouble the one there, Robbie. It was all over the parish talking about dismissing his high team for nothing. Oh, God. Yo, <laughs> so Red Hills with a very good start dismissing. Come on, Chip. The high hitting Rabbi for one. Oh, I don't know. Oh, One thing for sure, this Red Hills team can celebrating as yet. Chippers. Because the team possess some very, very good players. One of them Jesus is now at the crease. The man called Soup Gilded. 
He was the man of the match last week with a very, very steady 41. What it going? Can he get it this week? Also in the pavilion, we have Dimbo. So it's Super Gelding and Bimbo at the crease. Oh, and that was well played. All right, he's a better Jeff, ball, Jeff, Jeff, Jeff. The crease. Getting that ball to angle in. So this is a very important duo at the crease, Bimbo and Wiley. This will determine how close height get to the total. What's up? What But I think Hyde have a chump card in the pavilion with the hard hitting all around the Rascadel who took five wickets while bowling. He can dispatch them into the pavilion. Oh God! And Laro is half and away. This is a grudge match. No, sir. This is a no, match with a lot of steam. We have the Reddings fans in his knickers. Yes, sir. Redding come with Hyle. So the score is high blasters in a spin. They are three wickets down for one run. <laughs> Why you kind of signal at put up Stay in? Clear. 96 runs to win with Chip Chip steaming out of his cage. I'm going to bowl him now, I'm going to bowl him now. Yeah, bowl him now. So we have Samora getting promotion from number nine. Larry up to Samora. Oh, and he didn't even see that. Yeah, so Samora played about two minutes after the ball had passed. Come on, Larry. So Captain Rabbi has decided to promote Samora up into the middle order. Someone who is a genuine tail ender looking to repay his keeper. Catch him up. Catch him up. Oh, and that's well played. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moshe, The Reddings team have players from different origin out there. They have a few Spanish players, a few from Zimbabwe. And one Sri Lankan who was just speaking just now. So it's Laru into ball to Super Gelding. Full length delivery. Yeah, man, and change the match. Change the game. Yeah, man, change the game, man. So you can see. Chep Chep using all his experience, using the crease. That delivery was delivered very wide of the crease to try to get that ball to uh, dip you feel like watching some under the bottom of Samora. <laughs> so, watch him warm me up load it on YouTube. And that was a gift by Laru. And while he decided to unwrap that gift before Christmas Day. While he was very important. While he was very important in the run chase last week, and he's even more important now. So, Chep Chep steaming in. Come on, come oh, on. That's another good delivery. Chep Chep with a round arm action. Talk to him, Wiley. Very difficult to pick up. Tell him how to do it, Wiley, how to kick out the ball. Show me front foot. Yes. Oh, and that's a brilliant delivery. Laru after being slapped over square leg for six. Oh, it took a big chunk of the outside edge. Yo, the man coming at space, you know? <laughs> And that flew. Yeah, the man coming at space, We had Jason there who made the transfer from Hype to Reddills. Yes. No, man, you come trade now and you come, man. Oh, God. 
So chip chip up to ball to Samora. Samora with a very weird technique. It's called a snake technique. I think that is very good running between the wicket. Time was behind time right there. Come aside. So Hyde does it, is now 13 for 3. Batsman at, in the pavilion. Batsman back in the pavilion is Robbie for 1. Bowled by LaRue. <laughs> Eaton bowled by Chep Chep for a duck. And the big man serves wicket of Bimbo who was cleaned up by LaRue. LaRue run off all the way to Swansea can come back. So chip chip. So Super Gelden using all his experience. The goat was moving behind the bowler's arm. So it's up to, up to ball to Wiley. Oh, and that's a good play. Good forward defense. The legs tight and closed. No way he can go through there. So it's Wiley up to ball to somewhere. And that's yes. a good forward defensive shot by Samora. You see, I'm only six Wiley. So Samora. Samora. You want not to know Wiley. Everybody today. This man is associated, associated with making ducks, but so far he's on five. Oh, he missed a shot. And it's Teddy Brock shot spinning in the leggings. Come on, Teddy Brock shot. What that? I still can't believe that Hyde only got one for that runs because Teddy Brock shot. One strike. Sure, Teddy Brock shot should have circulation problem after this game. Oh, and that's well played by Samora. Well played by Samora. Good forward defense. I look like that. Okay, this game, so. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Like that, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I want to feel that boy. I'm going to feel that boy. I'm going to feel that boy. Yeah. Right, don't need anything. Oh, God. So, Chip Chip looking for the breakthrough. With another back of a length delivery outside of some Samora. Not interested. Come on, Chepi. Come on, Chepi. Come so on, Wiley. Look, two I six. This is experience batting by eyes. They know yeah, man, awesome, man. the tail is very close. Another wicket, and they're in trouble. So these two experienced cricketers. Oh, and that's another oh, no. delivery. Side, you know. In yes. the Reddings innings, <laughs> can he convert that farm into his batting? Watch out! Watch out! So that was well played by Gadel. So Chep Chep. Come on, Chep Chep, a roster that he with. Two wickets to his name, steaming in. Looking for a third. Wow. And that was well played by Gaden. Uh, oh, it's a jog. So the score is 14 for 4. Chasing mm. 96 runs. Hide in trouble so far. Oh, sorry. Stop <laughs> it. God, Larry, that's you. You didn't see Trips at the car. Super Gaden showing his super skills. Good. Showing that he have a PhD in gymnastic. <laughs> chip chip. Oh, and that's a brilliant delivery. 
That missed it off some by a hinge or less. So Laru looking to keep the pressure on from this end to go to Wiley. Wiley looking to use his feet to try and disrupt the length of the bowler. So far, it has proved unsuccessful. So this match seems like it's going to have a very good ending. Chep Chep, very noticeable this evening that he doesn't have a lot of pace. Seems like he's Chep Chep up the ball to Rasgel. Oh no, no, no. easy, easy, my <laughs> So Rasgadel trying to deal in sixes. Come on, oh, man! It's a good stroke. This definitely is rank with the cover. The shot that time he played through the covers. As the top shot for the day. As I stated earlier, while he's a very, very important player in this middle order, if Riddles can get rid his wicket. Jesus. And that was brilliant feeling by Timey. If only he had time it a little bit better. <laughs> so Raskelin, Raskadel, sorry, was on vacation and he's back down here. <laughs> so Chip Chip up in. in. Experience Chip Chip I used to them. Oh, and that's one of Gadel's favorite shots. Over the cover boundary for four by Raskadel. Yo! Hey, Jack! Hey, Jack! Laru, Laru! Um, Laru, is, man, man. Laru is very upset with Teddy Brock shot, but he must understand that that legging is very tight. It's squeezing his brain, so it's very hard to think about. Oh, so Laru still focusing on the misfield by. Teddy Brock shot when he got a beautiful catch. Watch it. So, Chep Chep once again. I think that job catch by Laru will prove very crucial. So, Hyde Blasters is 23 for 4. Chasing 96 runs. So, Batsman at the crease, we have Wiley on 12 and Gadel on 4. The four wickets that has been taken by Reddings is split to a piece by Chep Chep and Laro. Another full leg delivery on leg stump. I'm sure Gadel missing out on that one. So Chep Chep once more. Oh, and that was well played. Well played and a very good single. Good calling by Ras Gadel. I think if he walk with the ball a little bit, it should help. Can Wiley get this team over the line? I think the wicket of Super Gelded is the crucial wicket here. Oh, and well played. So Ras Gadel using all his tennis ball cricket experience to manipulate the field. So we have Ravers Cravers rolling in. Leather boy, leather. You can see the bunks. Two bossy man pass and now you have Ravers Cravers and Shepherd. Shepherd of the flock. This is very, very experienced batted by Wiley. 
waiting yeah. for the bad deliveries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, and another beautiful shot into the boundary for four. I just saw him on the wheel, you know. Beautiful shot. Yeah, man, he'll keep up, he'll keep up, he'll keep up. Go on, 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 so Teddy Brock shot, yes, pointing his orange polo shot, tucked into his leggings. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, there, for all who don't know, there always been a rivalry between Gadel and Larue. Gadel like to put Larue deliveries into the fence. So it's 29 for four. And that's another good delivery by Chep Chep. I think Hyde is approaching this partnership very well. They know this Reddy's team doesn't have good change bowlers. They're just trying to wear out these two. Oh, oh good delivery. Very good delivery. Laro sponsored by Real Madrid. <laughs> yes, no. Can he take his catch? Oh, oh that's a good catch by yes, Rada. And that was a yes, good catch by Rada. Running in from the mid-wicket fence to take a good catch. And I think that shot was there. Extra bounce. That was sticky. He's a so the new batsman at the crease is knee up. This man can score a century with those knee cups. So Chep Chep looking for another wicket. Oh, and that miss by a... So Laru up the ball to Nico. <laughs> and Nico living up to his name. That is a very good forward defensive shot with pure Nico. So Chep Chep once more up the ball to Wiley. You see them ball? Well, go, send in the go back here. So the score. Hyde struggling at 30 for 5. But they still have Super Gelding at the crease. So they still have a chance. Let's see what's going to happen. Good batting by Nikop. Nikop seems like he's playing for bad light. Yes, <laughs> Yes, and that was a good delivery. Beaten outside the half stump. It is very clear that. It is very clear that that ball didn't go near the, the gloves. Oh, that's a good shot delivery. Into the windpipe of Nico. So Nico with a very good. So it's Chep Chep once more to Super Gelding. Hey, Chep Chep has some ball, eh? Is it in pass? Super Gelding was the man yeah. to brought home Hyde's side against Gibraltar last week. Can he do it again? Come on, Nico, come on! So Hyde need another 67 runs to win. So news coming into the comments area that boy blue is the president of all geldings. So yes. for no one is now named President Boy Blue Gelding. <laughs> Presidential candidate. Back to the, back to 
to the game and that delivery seemed to hit. That was very high up on his hand. To be honest, that hit him just below the elbow. All right, all right. But a very good delivery from Laurent. So Chep Chep looking to wrap things up with a slow delivery. So Hyde really in at 30 for 6. All the big bats in the pavilion. Can Nick up do it? Oh, and that's another good delivery. Batsman is buzzing. And that was well played. Oh, so, the ball, I'm sorry. Hey, bowling good today. So, can Bazzi recover? Both sides. Yeah, man, both sides. Yeah. Get him. Can't move it. So, Bazzi beating for pace right there. Beating for pace. I'm going to move fast. Can I say, but later, come. Check in. Check in. It's 30 for 6. Oh, that's flashed away by Bazzi. Into the body for four. Laro seems yeah. like he's looking in the grandstand and not focusing on the game. Just want to be on Laro. Give him a fast, Laro. I want to do fast. So, once more. So, it's now 34 for six. Can Hyde recover? And Nikop living up to his name. <laughs> he have everything behind that. Nikop. True man, if you're a bad man, you have lawyer money for them. Oh, no, no! Oh, and that's, that's well played by Bazzi. We're hoping that this game could get more competitive. It seems like these two guys can bring back the game for high blasters. So it's Laro. Oh, God! So it's Chip Chip. Up to ball to. So the score is 35. Yo, you know what's name, Oh, and that's well played by Bassi. Yeah, well done, dear man. Bless him, man. No, you can't do anything. Come on. So news coming in is that Chip Chip is bowling too wide. Yeah. He needs to go into the crease. Oh. No, no, Ah, one second, one second on the game. Chip Pass. Chip, you have the outside box here. Well, I'm, I'm still going back there. That's why we try to crease them here. Yeah? You know what you get, man? You have to go the box. You have to go in that box. All right, all right, all right. I know that now. All right, all right. I'm going to go to the chip. I'm going to go to the chip. I'm going to go to the chip. So Nikop seemed to be enjoying the rivalry with Laru. And that's another short delivery. So can Bazi stay there as Nikop says? That's another a high delivery. Hitting Bazzi. Oh. Yeah, yeah. 
Acha, acha, acha. Acha, acha. Acha, so we have Chep Chep looking to wrap things up for Reddings into ball to Bassi. And that was well played. And another quick single. Outside now, one more. So finally another score on the total. Nico, look like he needs a gun now. It's now 37 for 6. Oh God. Oh I got I'm a I am a one. gone. Yeah, man, football. So the score is now 38 for 6. So it's 38 for 6. Chip Chip looking for another wicket. And well played by Buzzy. Hey, you know, Buzzy wants to drive yeah. So Chip Chip with 4 wickets to his name, looking for another 5 wicket all. <laughs> Easy! Easy, Nico! You ain't need them drop out! <laughs> To be honest, I am very surprised by the stamina showed by these two Reddings bowlers. So Nikob swung that way. And another single to the total. Nikob break them now. So Hyde creeping up to 39 for 6. One very important point is that Gibraltar Reddings was also struggling at 30 something for 6 and recovered to make 97. Can Hyde do the same? <laughs> what a chip chip! Yeah, I'm not sure if you're going to to <laughs> so that one hit on his tie. So Laru up to go to Bazi. Oh, and that's a good stroke. And Jason seems like hands are four. So Jason seemed like he had a dozen hot egg in his hand. <laughs> So it's now 43 for 6. Buzzy looking. Buzzy and Nick up trying to resurrect the high team. And that was well played. And Jason again. So Jason, after being transferred from high to ready for a dozen hooker. He only contributed six runs, so he's still whole ready six occurs. So once again, chep chep into ball to Nico. <laughs> a football here, play man. And it seems like it's a clear plan from the high glasses team to draw this game. <laughs> so Bazzi. Oh, that's a brilliant shot by Bazzi. And while it Laru was dispatched into the wide side, it's time for six. I'm 
been down at all. So everybody is talking about join the match. But Bazi have had ideas. Bazi is dealing in sixes. So the score is now 55 for 6. Bazi looking to bring this one home for hype. Low under a bit of pressure. Oh, and that was well played. And it's timing. Trying to time that dive. So Bazi is sending. So Bazi is sending a message to the height skipper that he need a promotion in the batting lineup. Easy now, Nico, Nico, man. I'm going to knock out your knee. Yes, man, yes, man. Yes, man. Knock him again, Laru. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
Injure man a bull. Yes, yes, yes. 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 So I'm asking, I'm asking the, the high glasses vice captain Bimbo to come and I know what the I'm kid. Chef, Chef, come in, Chef, Chef. Once again, we have ready and securing their second crate of Heineken to be handed over by Ras Gadel, senior player from Eye Blasters, the man who took five wickets. Do the handover, please. In the true spirit of the game, Redis came out, and this is very professional by Gadel. It's important. So we're asking to have a few words with Ras Gadel before we speak to the victorious Redis. So Ras Gadel, after a superstar bowling performance where you took five for four. At one point we saw you went down injured and quickly the medical staff was able to get you back on the attack. In that moment I think I was in the driver's seat. What happened when you came off the attack? Your team conceded about 50 runs in a very short space of time. Well, I was feeling a bit of pain in the joints you know, and I said I'm not going to force it. So I take a break from it. But apart from that, I was having a good spell, good team spirit. But then when I take the break, I feel some itchy. So get off the attack, get a little rest. The backup bowlers gave away a few runs, which is a part of cricket. But at the end of the day, our skipper didn't motivate us enough. Even in my second spell, I was a bit indisciplined to walk off the bowling, which I need to get my hunger under control but at the end of the day it's a team sport and you need to cheer on your players when they are doing good and not only see the fault and today you need no glasses our bowlers big deep our batsman let you down poorly so it's always important to look at yourself first before you speak to your team so i must respect that from ras gadel but one final question after dismissing readings for 97 runs at the start of the run chase did you have any any doubt of your team getting to the target no i had no doubt because based upon the team on paper but it's what you go and do on the day we got a bad start then myself and wiley tripping and trying to build a partnership i got carried away out carelessly then down the hand van put on a superstar performance but at soft already they did what it it took to be victorious i ain't find no fault you just have to go back regroup and try to be victorious the next game well said well said Gadel. and it was a brilliant goal in this play i think you're the third bowler to take five wickets so far the man <laughs> so now we are going to speak with the man of the match and the skipper of radius the man called Chippers. So Chip Chip, your second victory so far. This was one of the best all-round performances I've seen. You made the top score of 42, then chip in with a five wicket all. What did you think contribute to such a very good all-round performance that eventually led your team to victory? Yeah, for the moment you go there, we just want to go there with a good team sport, eh? uh, We made a plan, I wish I right, we're going to stick to that plan. And see how that plan works. 
just before the game started, um, chip, chip, I called you to find out what is the plan for this game and you stated that this high team won't last long against your bowling attack and it really happened. You were able to dismiss them for 70 runs and this 70 runs was beefed up by a swashbuckling not by Buzzy. I'm sure Buzzy is sending signals that he needs promotion up the order. <laughs> so in regards to your batting chip chip, did you think that 97 runs was a good total? Yeah, because I really want to go out and we are pressure. So we see if we can get it up, even up to the 90 or over 100 little bit. We have the man of pressure because we know we have a good attack and we have some good ball. Thank you. Okay, one final question, Chip Chip. With November coming up, we're planning to start our 2020 league. This is where you're going to need five bowlers to bowl. Based on Reddy's performance so far, I've only seen three bowlers. How will you be able to get your team ready for such a tournament where you will be only able to bowl four overs? This year the pitch can do anything, you know, but it's just that they're not really fussy and true, it's just a bowl out thing. And we don't know like running out of steam. You know me bowl, I know me of steam. So we just come out and run again. Well said, well said, um well said, um chip chip. We have three Sundays to go before we get into the 2020 league. If you could choose one more team to play before the T20 league starts, which team is that? Top Tone. Top Tone. I would like to play Top Tone again. Top tone. I really want a rematch on them. Because <laughs> really and truly, we put up a fight, we don't know what they are. And if the game plan was stick to that way, we wouldn't think about it. We didn't give a good fight. Thank you. For some reason, I knew you would say that. <laughs> on that day, your ball went on vacation all over the park. <laughs> I'm sure you want revenge. But anyway, I think it was a good victory. Very entertaining game in the end. And hats off to the Reddings team. We have a lot of youngsters in their team. Um, very good game. The fans loved it. At one point, we thought it was going to be a very boring game. But in the end, Bazzi brought back that intensity. And the Reddings was able to get over the line. Congrats, Reddings. And big up Hyde for a good game as well. So we, are, we just want to say big up to our sponsors. Firstly, we want to uh, ever sit media for live consistent coverage of the softball tennis league. Also, we want to big up Frost Khalifa for the Flyers. As well, big up all the Top Town Sports Club members for always coming out and making sure that this is possible. Special, special mention to Jagabas, the resident groundsman slash curator, who once again prepared a belt of a wicket that brought a very competitive game. Also, we're going to do an hour after party where we have ZJ Top Shelf and DJ Jagabas working shortly. So, if the man never in a hurry, they'll stay back for the after party. Big DJ, this DJ Top Shelf. Blessings. I want him Top Shelf. See these?